Yo, what's up everybody? It's your boy Floss, back again with another video. And today we're gonna take a look at the Dot Case Pro Explorer Edition. Now you can pick this one up online, I'll throw the link up in the description. The price on this one, 100 bucks. Now if you watch my videos, every time you see me buy a new laptop, the first thing I get is a dot case. Now as much as I love this one, there was one thing missing and they finally added it. All right, so before we unbox it, Take a look at this promo video. Introducing DotCase, the perfect hub solution that combines functionality with style. Click D key to switch functions at will. 95 watt power delivery fully charges your host device. Adjustable power prevents the Steam Deck SPMIC from burning out during charging. Enhanced flexibility however you play. Say goodbye to buffering and slow downloads and get ready to take your online experience to the next level with Gigabit Ethernet. Enjoy a new level of clarity and realism in your favorite movies, TV shows, and games. Experience seamless connectivity with both USB-A and USB-C ports. Detachable design, adjustable cable, sustainable life. Say goodbye to bulky bricks, take your smart hub anywhere. Dot case, your choice, your style. All right, so you've seen it for yourself. This is one of those simple and effective tech products that I highly recommend. Now I got one of these on all of my laptops, all of my computers, and I never travel without it. But like I said earlier, the only thing that was missing was an ethernet input, and now we got that. And one quick side note, here's my office upstairs, and if you zoom in, there's a dot case. You see that little display on the front? Beautiful. Now I wanna show you the website. Go to dotcase.com. Now this one's gonna run you 99 bucks. It comes in two different versions. You got the dot case and the dot case pro. I'll talk about the differences in a second. All right, so this is a six in one smart USB-C hub, the Explorer edition. As far as the features, you got 4K 60 Hertz for your monitors. You got PD 3.0 power delivery. You got 1000 megabits per second for your ethernet. You got USB 3.2 generation one, and this is compatible for Steam Deck and Nintendo Switch. Okay, choose your style and check this out. Now here's another upgrade, the color display. Now in this one, you can't see it right now because it's off, but the display doesn't have any colors on it. Now you got a bright, vibrant, colorful display, and I love that transparent design. Okay, again, Steam Deck and Switch compatible, and it's also redesigned for your M2 series, for all y'all that's in the uh, Apple ecosystem. Okay, 1000 megabits per second ethernet, the missing link. Look at the design. Now I love that see-through transparent look, beautiful. You got active cooling, and here's the specs. Now here's the difference between the Dot Case and the Dot Case Pro. The Dot Case, that's gonna be 89 bucks. The Dot Case Pro, 99 bucks. The only difference is, Ethernet. Now, if you don't need Ethernet, go with the regular dot case and you get an extra USB. All right, so this is the Pro 100 bucks. Let's grab a little unboxing knife, what I got today. The John Wick special, here we go. Shout out to White Shoes, she got the day off. Let's get up in there, right. Okay, let's see, did I miss anything? Okay, everything from the website. Again, now we're gonna keep this video short and sweet, simple and effective tech. Now it comes with a nice USB Type-C, the USB Type-C cable, braided, very thick. Another upgrade from the original that had this little flimsy one. Look at the difference. Okay, I like this. Okay, flick of the wrist. Flick of the wrist, usual books and shit, pluck them and follow them, and here we go. Oh, check this out. <laughs> now that's what I'm talking about. Hold up, right. All aluminum and tempered glass. Okay, check this out. Got a little button right there. That's gonna be your mode switch. USB Type-C, USB-A, USB-A, HDMI, USB Type-C, PD, and Ethernet. Okay, Ethernet. Now with the old one I had, this one actually had a big US, uh, big um, SD card slot, but you don't really need that. A lot of laptops gonna have an SD card slot or micro SD card slot, but a lot of laptops, including my Samsung one that I'm getting ready to pull out right now, do not have ethernet options. So this is a good look right here. All right, so let me grab a laptop and let's plug it in. 
All right, so before I plug it in, let me show you exactly what I was talking about. Now here's one of my favorite travel laptops, the Samsung Galaxy Book 3 Ultra. Now this is a beast right here, but on one side, if you notice, you got micro SD card slot, USB-A, on the other side, HDMI, USB Type-C. No ethernet options. This is where this is gonna come into play. All right, so now let's go ahead and set this up and I'm gonna zoom in a little bit closer so you can see this display. And all you gotta do is plug in the USB Type-C into your laptop. You're gonna grab your dot case and plug it in. Simple and straightforward. Now you got this beautiful LCD display that shows you the actual power output for each input. Now you do have a multifunctional button. So say I wanna set up my HDMI. Okay, I can configure it, change all of the settings right from the USB hub. Look at that. Now let's go back to the main screen. Okay, so let's plug some stuff in. Now I got a camera. Let's plug in my camera. Okay, and you see it shows right there. Now I got controller. Plug in my video game controller. Okay, it's right there. And um, let me grab another USB cable. Actually, okay, I got USB Type-C cable. I'm gonna plug this in to the power delivery and watch this. Grab an iPhone, plug in my iPhone, and the iPhone is charging up, and you see all of the information on display. Now I can still plug in my HDMI and my ethernet, and I have one more USB Type-C. Simple and effective tech. But how cool is this gonna look on your laptop, okay? On your desktop setup, with all of these beautiful colors and transparent design, form and functionality, okay? I like this. All right, so real quick, let me show you the difference in the displays. Now here's the original, and here's the new one. Now the new one, the display is a lot brighter, more colorful, and actually has more functionality. All right, so overall, on a scale of one to 10, I'm giving the Dot Case Pro Explorer Edition a major, major, major go. This is a must have item for me. I've been using Dot Cases for years, so I highly recommend them. This is a textbook definition of simple and effective tech. A product that looks awesome and everything works. What more do you need? Anyway, hit me up in the comments. Let me know what y'all think about this one. Shout out to everybody rocking with me on Facebook, Foursquare, Twitter, Google Plus. Shout out to all the Google gangsters. I see y'all holding down that Facebook page. Shout out to everybody hitting me up on Boxer. And a special shout out to everybody rocking with me on Instagram. Y'all know that's where I'm at full time, 100% full throttle. And a special shout out to everybody rocking with the new stream on Sundays. Y'all already know, stream gangsters on deck. Get your drinks ready. No meat boys allowed. Oh yeah, special shout out to everybody following me on Snapchat, Flossy underscore Carter, that's where I'm at. And a special shout out to the notification squad. I see y'all in the comment section early. Hashtag salute. Oh yeah, one more thing. I almost forgot. Fellas, ladies, say it with me. All y'all haters, all y'all trolls, close your eyes. And pitch him both. It's your boy Floss and Matt. Deuces. Spock won the beam up. Energize. some of that technology you gotta understand certain things subscribe to Flossy Carter he does reviews of all the latest technology the iPhones, the iPads, the Galaxies the Samsungs, whatever the fuck the Beats by that Dr. Guy and he puts his kitty cat in the videos too for you something to look at you know I'm an animal lover so I like that shit 
So make sure you hit the subscribe button, the Flushy Carter on the YouTube, the follow button on the Insta face, and the like button on the face look. Because if you don't, we're going to have a fucking problem here. A bad one. Now hit the fucking subscribe button.